Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Speaking Arabic using the spoken Jordanian dialect. Today's episode is the second part of the space series where we're going to be exclusively talking about the solar system. You have also requested a few terms and phrases in the comments from part one, so those will be also included in today's episode, all in the Levantine Jordanian dialect. Now guys, if you haven't yet done so, make sure that you subscribe, hit the bell notification button and like this video for more daily content like this. And let's get started. Yalla. The solar system planets we're covering today will start with the Sun, then go to Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto. In addition, the special requests we're covering today are astronaut, meteorite, satellite, and then the two phrases are Big Bang Theory and Parallel Universe. Let's start with solar system. Al-Majmu'a Shamsiya. Al-Majmu'a Shamsiya. And remember that a sun is Shams. Shams. And a planet is Kawkab. Kawkab. Great. Let's go ahead and start with our first planet, and that is Mercury. Utarid. Utarid. Now, guys, first is Il Awal. So when we say the first planet is Mercury, it is Il Kawkab Il Awal Huwa Utarid. Now let's dive into our second planet, and that is Venus. Is Zahra. Is Zahra. Second in Arabic is Itani. So the second planet is Venus, goes as Il Kawkab Itani, who was Zahra. Our third planet, its home, and that is Earth. Il Ard. Il Ard. And since we're talking about third, it's Italit. So the third planet is Earth. Il Kawkab Italit Hu Il Ard. On to the fourth, and that is Mars. Il Marich, Il Marich. Fourth in Arabic is Raba. So the fourth planet is Mars. Il Kawkab Raba, who will Marich. Great. On to number five. Jupiter. And in Arabic it is Il Mushtari. Il Mushtari. It's the largest planet. Fifth in Arabic is Il Khamis. So the fifth planet is Jupiter. Il Kawkab Il Khamis Hu Il Mushtari. Great. Number six. The one with the rings is Saturn. Zuhal. Zuhal. And sixth in Arabic is Isadis. So the sixth planet is Saturn. Il Kawkab Isadis Huwe Zuhal. Number seven, Uranus, Uranus, Uranus. 
Pretty close, huh? So seventh in Arabic is, is Saba. The seventh planet is Uranus. الكوكب السابع هو أورانوس. And number eight is Neptune. And in Arabic, it's pretty close. Nipton. Nipton. And eighth in Arabic is Ittamen. So the eighth planet is Neptune. Il kawkab ittamen huwa Neptun. And then the final planet, a special mention. That is our dwarf planet here, Pluto. Pluto in Arabic as well, Pluto. Now when we say Pluto is a dwarf planet, it is Pluto Kaukab Qazam. Pluto Kaukab Qazam. This concludes the solar system planets here. We're going to be reviewing all of these in a minute, but let's take a quick minute and cover the special requests. We'll start with astronaut. For a male astronaut, it is Ra'id Fada. Ra'id Fada. And a female astronaut, Ra'idat Fada. Ra'idat Fada. Good news, it's the same in MSA as well. Now the meteorite, Nazak. Nazak. And Nazak is a male noun or a masculine noun. So we'd say Hada Nazak. And the plural form, meteorites, Nayazik. Nayazik. The last word is satellite. Amar Sinai. Amar Sinai. And that is a masculine noun. Hada Amar Sinai. And the plural form for satellites, Amar Sinai. Amar Sinai. Now the phrases, the first phrase is Big Bang, and that is Al Infijar Al Azim. Al Infijar Al Azim. So when we say Big Bang Theory, it is Nadariyat Al Infijar Al Azim. Nadariyat Al Infijar Al Azim. And then Parallel Universe was the other requested phrase, and that is Alam Muwazi. Alam Muwazi. All right, guys, let's review. Yalla. Mercury, Utarid. Venus, Is Zahra. Earth, Il Ard. Mars, Il Marrikh. Jupiter, Il Mushtari. Saturn, Zuhal, Uranus, Uranus, Neptune, Nipton, Pluto is Pluto. And astronaut for male, Ra'id Fada'. For female, Ra'idat Fada'. Meteorite, Nazak. Satellite, Amar Sinai. And then last but not least, first, il awal, second, itani, third, italet, fourth, irrabe, fifth, il khamis, sixth, is sadis, seventh, is sabe, eighth, Itamen. All right, guys, this concludes the solar system episode today. 
Let me know if there is anything else you'd like me to cover in the context of outer space in the comments below. And make sure that you do watch the first part to go over these terms that you might have missed if you haven't watched it yet. Congratulations, you have completed today's lesson. Guys, if you haven't yet done so, make sure that you are subscribed and that you've liked this video. And do share this video with anyone else who could benefit from this content. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with a new series and a new topic. Have a great day.